Hello and welcome everyone. If you're new to this channel, then my name is Amit Patel and you are watching the live show Musings with Software Engineers. Shreyan Shigalwa, data scientist versus web development versus artificial intelligence and machine learning expert. Shreyan, first thing is start with web development. Web development is easier to start. Web development is easier to get a job. Web development is easier to get into a software company. So start with web development. While you are doing web development, you may come across machine learning and artificial intelligence. More than 25 to 30 to 40 percent jobs in today's date are using some kind of a machine learning code or artificial intelligence code. And they, they are not even looking for AI or ML, ML engineers. They are looking for software engineers who know web development and they are asking them to learn machine learning or they are telling them to implement certain code. Correct. So even as a web developer, you can start learning machine learning and artificial intelligence. And when you learn data science, you cover everything. You cover web development also, machine learning also, artificial intelligence also. So if you become a data engineer, an engineer who understands data science, who can do artificial intelligence, who can do machine learning, then you are a very valuable engineer. If you are a web developer, your average salary, starting salary is somewhere between 2.5 lakhs per annum to around 3.5 lakhs per annum, 2 lakhs per annum to 3.5 lakhs per annum. If you know machine learning and artificial intelligence, then your salary will be between 6.5 to 7 lakhs per annum. And if you are a data science engineer, if you are a data engineer, what it is called in the industry, who knows data science, who knows artificial intelligence, who knows machine learning, who can build a web application, then your salary can go beyond 10 lakhs per annum, even as a fresher. Okay, so I know that your question, which which is good from salary point of view, this is my answer. Okay. But I would say, start somewhere. Don't wait that you will become this Arjuna. Okay, because by the time you become the Arjuna, the war will be over. Your requirement may not remain. Correct. So start in the industry, start getting experience. There is a whole lot more. Your salary does not depend on your technical skills. Your salary depends on what I call as four P's, four P. Your potential, your prowess, your performance, and your progress. Okay. There are four P's to your salary. Okay. Why do you need potential? Because potential is your selling point. Okay. Potential are the qualities in you because of which companies will hire you. Potential is your inherent qualities because of which company will look at your resume and company will say, okay, you come and work for us. That is your potential, your hidden qualities, which people can see clearly. Prowess is your expertise, your technical skills. How much software development do you know? How good are your communication skills? How well can you read, write and speak? Okay, prowess is your expertise. Expertise about domain, expertise about business in which you are doing your software development. So that is your second P. Why do you need prowess? Because on the basis of your prowess, you will get the job. So in this case, in this example, the prowess is artificial intelligence and machine learning is the expertise or data science is the expertise or web development is the expertise. Correct. The third P is your performance. 
how good you are in organizing your work how good you are in your time management skills how good are you in delivering quality product in an efficient manner what are the results you can produce based on your potential and prowess that is your performance why you need performance because that defines your result that you can produce for this company and then finally comes your progress what is your progress where did you start what have you achieved in your engineering what have you achieved what is your progress okay you were not a programmer now you are a programmer you did not know java programming now you know java programming now you know data structures in java now you know algorithms in java okay now you know j2ee or spring hibernate framework in java boot uh, spring boot in java correct so that is your progress where did you start where have you reached how are you making your own plan that is your progress so your salary does not depend just on your skills your skills account to only 25% of your salary your salary depends on your potential your uh, prowess your performance and your progress okay and if you don't know what all these things are then you have to check my a players program but you have to check this page you have to check this page and there is a video on this page 13 minutes video which will explain you what gives you the best salaries is that okay so um, i know it it's it looks very cool that okay i know this and i will get a great salary uh, but does not happen that way okay um, if there are two people both of them know machine learning and artificial see technical skills everybody has them because that's what you went to college for if there were 100 people in class at least 10 people were very good in java programming let's say so you are competing with 10 people in at the school college level when you come into uh, applying you are competing with thousands of people they have the same knowledge that you have they have studied from the same books they know the same coding patterns everything same they know the same data structures they can write the same code so what differentiates you okay what differentiates you is your potential your prowess your performance and your progress okay when you understand this then you can sell yourself very easily all of you who are here please share this video with your friends like this video if you have not liked this video subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon because when you press the bell icon you will get the notification i am live every thursday at 9:05 pm okay